Hey everyone here from Tunnel Vision TV and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to create a nice glass texture in Maya 2017 using the new Arnold built-in renderer. So as you can see I've got a light bulb and I've got the texture applied. So I'm going to close the renderer and um, then I'm going to go to my hypershade, this little icon here at the top. And um, then I'm just going to delete the glass texture so I can show you guys how I created that or that material rather. So I'm just going to highlight it and press delete on the keyboard. And um, then here on the browser on the side, I'm going to go to Arnold and then Shader and then Surface. And I'm going to click on AI Standard just to create a new material. Uh, let me just remove this material below. Uh, same with this one. Just click on this little minus uh, like so. And then with this new uh, material selected, I'm just going to rename it. I'm going to call it Gloss. And um, then the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to change the diffuse to black. So just click on that white and then just change that to black. Scroll down slightly, go to specular. And the specular, I'm going to enable for now. Here at the bottom, just tick that. And then just up the weight slightly like that. And then this uh, slider here right at the bottom of specular, I'm not even sure how to pronounce that. But slide this up slightly, something like that. And then I'm going to go down to uh, Refraction and I'm going to set the weight all the way up to 1. So then very importantly we're going to change the IOR and we're going to slide it up to around 1.6. And this is the way the light is being bent as it's going through the glass basically. Alright so let's just test that and do a quick render. I'm going to highlight the bulb or the glass area. And um, then I'm going to right click on my glass material and I'm going to choose Assign Material to Selection. I'm just going to close the hypershade down and then I'm going to click on render. Let's see what happens. Okay, that's looking alright, but I can't see any specular highlights. So I'm just going to close that down, go back to the hypershade. And um, then we're going to go down to the specular and just make sure that the roughness is all the way down, just to make it nice and shiny. So let's close that down and then we're going to click on render again. Okay, that's looking a lot better. You can see uh, we've got the reflection of that light off to the side. Um, yeah, so play around with those settings. You'll be able to create some nice glass uh, materials in Maya 2017 using the new built-in Arnold renderer. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. And remember to click on that subscribe button for more tutorials. Cheers, bye.